what's up guys? Welcome back once again to another episode of Plunder Pirates. That's right guys, we are playing Plunder Pirates once again. We're moving on up. I am still loving this game. They fixed a lot of the server issues. They're still tweaking out some other stuff. But we are doing just fine. Uh, why don't we go ahead and start off this video. I'm going to show y'all uh, an attack that I just had. We only have one builder available because I have to upgrade my gold and my grog storage is because I'm filling them up too quick, <laughs> which I guess is a good thing. I just have to wait for them to fill up. So we're doing good from that standpoint. Um, and then I just upgraded a gold mine so that it wouldn't be too long. We also upgraded our academy. I believe we did that in the last video. That is done now. So we can come in here. We can train all these troops over again. But when we upgraded it, we got the juggernaut. And he is freaking ridiculous. So let's see if we can get 950,000. We need 350,000 more grog in this video. So let's see if we can get enough to upgrade him. Uh, because I have been using them. You can see that I have... Uh, how many? I have 10 of them trained out. That's the max you can use. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys an attack that I had recently that was ridiculous. So it's this bottom one right here. You can see 409,000 gold. Let's go ahead and replay this thing and talk about it. So I used 10 juggernauts on it. The juggernauts are kind of like brutes, except uh, they cost more. They take longer to train. They do way more damage from an attack standpoint. And they also disable mines. Uh, so they're they're pretty freaking sweet. So we're going to drop off... Uh, <clears throat> I think I dropped off eight up at the top and then two at the bottom just as distraction. And then we're going to let our gunners come up in behind them and do a little bit of cleanup. Now the only thing that sucks about the juggernauts is that they don't go after the defenses like the brutes do. So uh, that's the bigger difference. Uh, but I mean, it's, it generally still works pretty well. So... Uh, you can see that the we got some juggernauts in here in the middle working on this mortar, which is completely necessary. Actually, there's only one juggernaut in there. These juggernauts are over here just crushing everything. I wish that they hadn't stayed together as much because these mortars really, really need to get taken out. One funny thing that I always see happen with mortars is that they actually end up bouncing people over the walls. So they don't have to hit the walls anymore, which is freaking hilarious. Uh, so we have a couple of... where all, Do we even have any gunners left? Yeah, so we've got all of our gunners up here. None of the gunners that we dropped down here are alive. You can see they're skeletons. They're dead. They're dead on the beach. <laughs> but it's okay, because we do still have our juggernauts over here doing work. We'll go ahead and fast forward this. Uh, the juggernauts are still working their way around. We're working on the pirate hall right there, and it's about to go down because we've got... Who was on that? Just the juggernaut and then those gunners. Um, but these gunners are about to take out that gunner tower, that gun tower. Come on, take it out, take it out. No! Wow, I didn't even realize that when I was raiding that it was that close. <laughs> but anyways, we just got a ridiculous amount of gold from that attack. In fact, it filled up our storage, as you can see. Like 100,000 of it was wasted because we didn't have room for it. So that was why I went and upgraded that one thing right there, uh, the, uh, the gold storage. So uh, we have another army camp kind of like that chained up army camp we have another academy like that trained up so uh we're looking for grog now though all right so we're looking for grog let's see if we can find a base with a good amount of grog that we know we can destroy now you have to keep in mind with the juggernauts it's going to be harder to get them to go into the center so you want to try and find a base that's a little bit more compact uh so that they can work their way around that like there's way too many buildings on the outside of this one for me to uh try and get into the grog storage so uh we're just going to keep working our way around guys there is some exciting news that we are in the top 100 clans in the world i think we're like 68th or 69th right now uh which is awesome i said clan guild uh oh here we go you think we can do this one i am definitely going to try and get in there with our juggernauts all right so we're gonna drop off uh we're just gonna drop off a wall of them like this and then we're going to drop off some Buccaneers behind them to help out. And then we're going to save our Gunners now. All right, so we're going to save our Gunners uh, to come in once the Juggernauts and the Brute or the Buccaneers have all the aggro. We're losing a bunch of our Juggernauts over here around the side, which really sucks. I don't want them to go around the side of the base. Uh, so let's go ahead and let's drop off a couple Gunners to help clear out some of these buildings so that the Juggernauts do not... No, Juggernauts, go in. Go in. In. 
go into the base. See, I really don't want them to come over here to this building. So let's see if we can take this out. No, go in, go in. Yes, all right, perfect. So that was perfect. That's exactly what we needed to happen. We did, however, use a bunch of our gunners a little bit early. Um, we've got a herd of juggernauts over there on the side, but now we have all of these guys working their way in, which is going to get us into all of those storages. Right here, we got gold and grog storages right there um, on both sides. These juggernauts over here are being really dumb, but there's only three of them, so the majority of our juggernauts are still over here. There goes one of our gold storages, and we are going to use this ability, and we are going to use this ability. And we want our juggernauts to take out that mortar, first of all, because I freaking hate mortars in this game. <laughs> I mean, they're great when you're actually on defense, but when you're attacking, they just freaking annoy you so much because they knock you way, way back. Um, this juggernaut up here is doing a little bit of damage to this grog. We've only gotten probably like 75,000 grog or so. But we're getting more from this right here. But sadly... Uh, we really needed these. We really needed these guys. To, nice. See, it just hopped him over. Oh, but he died. <laughs> so all of our, pretty much all of our troops are done. Uh, are done for. I'm trying to think of other uh, strategies that we can use with the juggernauts like this. As you saw, what I probably should have done was dropped a couple over here and over here to clear out those sides first, and then drop them all from the top so that they would have just headed straight in. Um, so let's see how much loot we got. We got a, over 100,000 of each resource, so that's not too bad. Um, I am definitely okay with that, but look, we're, we're still at 700,000, and we, so we need 250 more to upgrade his health. Um, <clears throat> why don't we do, this could be funny, why don't, oh no, never mind, we can't do an all juggernaut attack, so we're going to train up 10 of them, and, uh, why don't we train up, uh, Let's train up four bombers and or five bombers. Let's get a couple of brutes in there. Tavern is full. We're gonna get rid of some of these guys. We want to do five. No. All right. So we're not gonna do any brutes. We're gonna do five bombers and then the rest. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Let's throw in five bucks. All right. Not five dollars, but five buccaneers. And let's go back. And plunder some more and we got to get guys we got to get all of this um, <clears throat> all this grog in this video so we need 250,000 more uh, there would have been enough on that last base but we just weren't able to get to all of it this base would be really freaking hard to get into <laughs> our base is gonna look like that one of these days though so hold on and we will be that promise um, all right, so I'll go ahead and cut here while we search. Oh my gosh, 901,000 grog. Are you kidding me? That's absurd. But look at his mortars. His mor he We can't do that. There's no way we can do that. Well, I'm happy I didn't leave yet because I really wanted you guys to see that. 900,000 grog. That is ridiculous. All right, so I'll go ahead and cut right here and uh, be back with you guys in just a couple of seconds, all right? All right, guys, so we're going to attack this one. Uh, I wasn't gone for that long. We're going to drop off um, all 10 of our guys. Well, let's just drop off like eight of them. All right, so we dropped off eight of them. And then we're going to drop off our bombers, and they should get us in here. The reason I'm attacking from this side is because all of his grog storages are, are on one side right there. We're going to drop off our bucks as well, get them in here. And uh, I'll go ahead and drop off my other two guys down here no head into the base what i don't know what they're doing up there but that's okay we'll get some of our gunners in there and now they're about to get in there to those grog storages we'll go ahead and use our bucks powers <clears throat> and you can see that yep all right so they're heading into all the grog storages right now perfect come on guys take them out take out the grog storages we're gonna use our gunners ability we're taking out we're working on two of the grog storages right now but this one over here is practically unscathed um, but these, uh, juggernauts, I just totally forgot their name, are working, we have one juggernaut working on this one, the mortar, another thing that sucks is it always changes your, your, the target of your troop, so like, the, one of these guys was going to come over to this one, but now he didn't because of the, <laughs> because of the mortar, but he's taking a good amount of damage, see now he's inside of it, so he has to run out, um, and that looks like that's all the grog that we're going to get. We just have a good amount of 
juggernauts right there, and I believe that we had one up here, but both of those are down. Uh, where are our gunners at? We've got some gunners up here. We've got a juggernaut up here doing stupid stuff. <laughs> now we're working on the gold, which is fine. I'm happy to get a good amount of gold, too. So we only need 50... Do we need 100,000 more? Was it 950? Yeah, so we need 100,000 more uh, grog to get exactly what we want. We are losing trophies right now, but... That's okay. Um, we can get them back up pretty easily. We're going to go ahead and finish that battle right there. Yes. And yes. How much did we get? 200,000? 169,000. All right. And 42,000 gold. So that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and train up one more army camp like that with 10 of our juggernauts. Um, well, here. Actually, let's do this. Let's do eight juggernauts. And um, let's do 20. Let's do 15 bucks. And then we'll throw in uh, 11 of our gunners, all right? And we'll go ahead and <clears throat> plunder one more time. We need 100,000 grog at least, all right? So um, I'll go ahead and search. And you guys let me know if y'all like searching with me. A lot of people on my class videos complain and say, Molt, we don't want to freaking watch you search. But if you guys don't mind, let me know. Good lands, look at all of that grog. If we could... No, if we could even get to one of those, that'd be ridiculous. All right, so maintenance is starting in 10 minutes. We need 100,000 uh, grog. I want to find a base that's a little bit better than that one. It's a little more well-organized. So uh, I'm not going to cut. We're just going to go through this as fast as we can because we only have five minutes. Um, hopefully it doesn't mess up my video. But we will uh, we'll get this, and we'll go back, and we'll do our upgrade. I need to attack very, very quickly. But I need 100,000 grog, so come on, baby. Give me, a hundred. was it 100,000 or 150,000? I think it's like 110,000, actually. Um, this one doesn't look too bad. We might be able to get in there. Uh, let's go ahead and fight this one. And we will, uh, we'll drop them all off right in like this area. We'll drop off some buccaneers over here and some buccaneers over here. And then we're going to drop off some gunners back behind them. We'll go ahead and use the Buccaneers' powers. We wanted to take out these side buildings over here so that the Juggernauts go in. And it looks like they should go in, hopefully, if we take out this uh, last thing. Go on. Go inside the walls. Go inside the walls. Good job, guys. All right, so they're working their way in. Some of them have already made it in because of a mortar splash, which is hilarious. I don't know. Why are they all doing that? All of them are walking down here. Wow. All right, so that's interesting. Um... We need to get all of this grog. We need to get all of the grog. Come on. There you go. Go after it. So we're getting the gold right now with our juggernauts, but they're being bounced around by the freaking mortar. <laughs> That's one reason why it would be good to have some uh, brutes in here as well. Uh, come on, guys. Let's go. All of our uh, buccaneers are down. We need to use our gunner's abilities. So they're working on these grog storages up here, but they are not doing that much damage to them. Uh, looks like we're getting more from this gold. Please take that out. Okay, starting in three minutes. <laughs> Come on, guys. Attack, you're on a time limit. The mortars are wrecking. They're wrecking them right now. There's no way we're going to get this before the break. Look at this. The mortar just knocked. They get one hit off, and then the mortar knocks them back. That's ridiculous. So that's when you need to. That's when you need to bring in some brutes. So maybe just use uh, five five juggernauts, maybe, and a couple of brutes, something like that. Um, we're not going to be able to get this. Yep, I know. Maintenance starting in three minutes. I got gotcha. you. So that one wasn't too hot. Uh, we definitely we definitely rushed that one though because of the maintenance break. Um, but let's go ahead and we'll finish this. Stop it. We'll finish this video up by upgrading. Well, here we'll just research something else. Um, we'll go in here and we will train up. Let's see what we can do with our gunners. Uh, what does this ability do? Boost damage caused when attacking the enemy's cannons. Yes, we'll train that up. And let's go back and why don't we train up? Can we train up anything else? No, 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 no. All right, so no more training. And then. I think all of our guns are up, all of our cannons are up, so we just need to get our gold storages up uh, so that we can upgrade some other stuff. Can we upgrade this gun tower? Nice. All right, so we're going to upgrade that gun tower, and that is going to be it, guys. We are about to hit a maintenance break. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you all are enjoying this series, guys. And as always, make sure you keep calm and plunder on for me, all right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.